President Yoweri Seven and his wife Janet joined mourners at All Saints Cathedral in Nakasero to pray for the soul of Yona Namawa, who succumbed to heart complications on Monday. In his address to the mourners, President Museven said not all death should be blamed on a predetermined plan. They put him in the scan and they saw where the problem was. It was the heart, there was something there, but it was too late. This was the problem now. So when you come here, you say, oh, God has called him, has God... Uh -uh, I don't like that. Uh, the, our people should be cautious about health. The president appealed to Ugandans to refrain from self-medication and instead seek professional medical help whenever they fail ill. That heart thing you, you are talking, they are talking about, the heart attack, came from a simple problem. Apparently he had a, a tooth problem for a long time, which was paining him. But instead of going to, 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 to get thorough medical care, he was always engaged in self-medication. Ugandans, be conscious about health. Go for medical checkup. Yonan Amawa's family and friends spoke fondly of the deceased. He has been for me, he's been an exceptional man, like, like all of you who had who are there yesterday, I can't really say much for so many, so many people have to speak and have so little time. My husband is not here. He's with the Lord. When he came to work, when he came to his family, he was always there for anyone who needed it. He was our mentor, a colleague, a friend, a great listener, and a symbol of security. Reverend Canon Geoffrey Biarugaba, who presided over the requiem service, advised the congregation to live righteous lives. Knocking at the door of your heart that you may open for him, and then he will include you in. Whatever your condition is, it is his business to deal with it, and he does deal with it to his satisfaction. Yonanamawa was the son of the late James Wapakabulu, who was the former Speaker of Parliament. He will be laid to rest on Saturday at the family's ancestral home in Mafudu Parish, Bubulo Sub County in Slonko District. Aaron Mukama, NTV Weekend Edition.